Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your girl Adriana BC. Tonight's video, I'm gonna be giving you guys my top 10 fruity fragrances that are ideal to be worn during the winter season. I know you guys love your spicy, woody, ambery, perhaps even incensey smelling fragrances for this time of the year. But sometimes, you know, I do enjoy a fruity fragrance or a hint of sweet fruity almost citrusy vibes in my fragrances backed up with some woody ambery even woody touches or maybe even some caramel so that's pretty much the gist of these fragrances these are essentially fruity fragrances extra punchy extra long lasting that will definitely cut through the cold months and of course just kind of like lift your mood a little bit especially on those really cold and dreary days when it's just looking really gray on your outside you guys so here is a pop of fruitiness to light up your day on those really you know dreary winter days so if you guys are interested in seeing my top 10 fruity fragrances for the winter season then by all means keep on watching if you guys are new here please don't leave the hitting that subscribe button make sure to hit that notification bell so that way you will be notified every single time i upload and for those of you who are my returning subscribers thank you guys for your continuous love and your kind support wow. So let's just get into it. First up, we have Casamarati Italica. And you guys know this beautiful fragrance. This scent is no stranger to you guys. And for me, it is a beautiful, scrumptious, fruity, powdery, sweet, almost like, um, I want to say like, it smells like a fruit pie. There's some almondy touches in here, some saffron, bourbon vanilla. So it's sweet, it's warm. It's a little bit fruity, but not, you know, this fragrance doesn't have like those fruity elements that kind of jumps out at you, but you definitely get those fruity touches in this perfume. It's smells warm a little bit sweet i do get a hint of spice to this beautiful perfume i think this is a very well-rounded fragrance that definitely captures those fruity elements with those kind of like cozy winter notes in it that makes it ideal to be worn during this time of year you guys so for me casamarita italica is definitely one of those warm happy feeling type of scents almost festive even christmasy type of fragrances that you can wear during the winter season that's very long lasting very strong very punchy and definitely it gives you a you know a mood booster you know on those really cold dreary days so this is a casamarati italica next up we have an oldie but a goodie and i'm talking about mark jacobs decadence it's been a minute and unfortunately this fragrance is discontinued but i had to tell you guys about it because i do have this fragrance in my perfume collection this is a beautiful spicy sweet woody fragrance there are some ambery touches in here a beautiful sweet intoxicating note of plum there's also some jasmine and some rose in this intoxicating long lasting very obnoxious smelling fragrance now this perfume let me just say to you guys this is for the winter okay it's for the winter it is a ladylike womanly it smells sexy and it has this like um it has this presence it smells sweet it almost smells like um I would say has some vanilla. Like, I'll argue if you guys want. I definitely think that there is some vanilla in this fragrance. This perfume does not list any um, vanilla, but there's something so sweet in here. So, of course, we have the jasmine, but I've never smelled jasmine this sweet, okay, and warm and intoxicating. So, for me, I'm definitely getting a lot of the rose, the jasmine and the rose. And again, that sexy plum note, you guys. This is, you know, again, it's a mature fragrance very womanly very elegant smelling and of course long lasting you cannot go wrong wearing this beautiful fruity fragrance fruity woody scent during the winter season you guys as a matter of fact any other time throughout the year other than fall this fragrance might be a little bit too strong but i do know some people do tend to wear this fragrance you know all year round because again once upon a time this was a very popular pick for many you guys so mark jacobs decadence this is definitely a very beautiful fruity fragrance to wear during the winter season that's long lasting punchy and you will get noticed wearing this beautiful scent and it will outshine the cold weather you guys <laughs> so this is Marc Jacobs decadence next up we have another big boy and I'm talking about room 1015's cherry pong the extra the parfum and again you guys this is another very rich decadent cherry fragrance with the essence of saffron there's some mimosa violets tonka bean and of course a very prominent leather note mixing with the patchouli for me i get a little bit of an incense almost smoky vibe to this beautiful perfume but you cannot go wrong this is an intoxicating fragrance you guys the cherry in here so it is bright 
decadent, rich, and almost juicy. Not a syrupy, sweet type of cherry, but a very rich cherry in this fragrance that is bright, you know, very captivating in the opening of this beautiful perfume. And it has more than one dimension to this scent, and it is the most intoxicating fragrance. It is a very intoxicating cherry scent, you guys. Love this perfume. This is a beautiful fragrance that will definitely cut through, you know, those winter months. I'm talking about, you know, longevity, projection, presence. This is a scent to be worn in the dead of cold and you will smell the scent. During the colder months, certain fragrances literally just disappear. They get sucked up and you don't really, you know, feel the fragrances or smell them. These are the fragrances, especially the first two. These are those type of scents that when you go outside, you will be engulfed in the fragrance, even in the freezing cold, you guys, and it will stay with you all day long. So this is Cherry Punk, the extract to perform. Definitely a very, you know, punchy fragrance to pull for during the winter season. Next up, I have another big boy for you guys, and I'm talking about Louis Vuitton's Ombre Nomad. This is a fruity, punchy, strong rose and oud fragrance with the essence of raspberries okay there's a very sweet punchy note of raspberry in here so that is not outshined by any means by the oud there is some amber wood in here so very strong you know incense notes in this fragrance a very big punchy perfume that kind of comes off almost leathery but in the opening you are met with a beautiful rose fruity raspberry essence that makes this fragrance very very appealing this perfume has a very strong and very bold presence to it and it can be easily you know um be received as a borderline unisex or even masculine scent but because of those fruity elements in the opening of this perfume this is a perfectly unisex fragrance and it is strong long lasting i'm telling you this is bang for your buck louis Vuitton did not play short and let's not even talk about the oud the oud in here is shining it is in your face it is bold it is not like those you know, traditional Western designer fragrances with, you know, with the oud, you know, completely dumped down. No, Louis Vuitton did not play shy with the oud in here and it is in your face, making this fragrance a beautiful fragrance to be worn during the winter season with enough playfulness to wear, you know, perhaps you're partying, you're out with your friends, any kind of, you know, night out event in the dead of the cold, Umbre Nomad is that girl, you guys. Definitely a very strong fragrance in my perfume collection. And I love wearing it, especially this time of the year. But I do tend to put this perfume all year round. So this is Ombre Nomad by Louis Vuitton. Next up, we have Casablanca's Swiss Arabian, you guys. And this perfume is a creeper, okay? This perfume creeps up on you in a very surprising way, okay? When you first spray this fragrance, it comes out citrusy, bright, and area a little bit juicy there's the essence of the grapes in here so and you're thinking to yourself like oh my god this is just a citrusy apple smelling perfume and in comes that warm ambery depth to this fragrance mixing with that sweet caramel this fragrance intensifies and grows very like i want to say it's almost it can be a little bit like almost obnoxious okay that ambery caramel essence in the base it is very like um it kind of gets really loud as it sits on the skin and it warms up with the temperature okay beautiful long lasting fragrance that projects and wears absolutely beautiful stays on your clothes for like days and days and days you guys you cannot go wrong pulling for this beautiful fragrance during the winter season it will shine and project for the gods so this is casablanca by swiss arabia next up we have cherry oud by golen you guys and i haven't heard anybody talk about this one in a minute you guys this is a beautiful fresh powdery rose and cherry fragrance with a hint of sweetness it is powdery and a little bit i would say there's a slight leathery touch to this perfume but you definitely get the presence of the oud a very refreshing very bright sophisticated classy smelling cherry and oud fragrance with the essence of rose very almost clean smelling in my opinion it is powdery a little bit sexy but definitely keeping it garland style this is a very 
classy and elegant smelling perfume you guys but of course with that very light cherry note and a very prominent oud base this perfume is definitely a long lasting fragrance not very punchy like most oud fragrances but this fragrance definitely has presence it lasts about eight hours on the skin and i think it is an absolutely beautiful you know fruity fragrance to wear during this time of year it kind of has that tone even though this fragrance can be worn all year round because of the oudy base and that slight leathery vibe to it this has a beautiful tone that can be worn definitely on those colder winter nights and i think it's an absolute joy to wear and again this fragrance stays with you for about eight hours so it is a beautiful wearing experience so this is cherry wood by galen next up we have sea intense by Giorgio armani and this is probably one of my most favorite like one of my most favorite fragrances in this lineup this is a beautiful syrupy sweet almost boozy black currant fragrance with the essence of rose it's a bit of a woody touch in the base and it is an absolutely beautiful elegant smelling perfume you guys i I love this fragrance. It smells a little bit um soapy, in my opinion. I want to say it's a black currant. The black currant has a, a tendency to come off a little bit soapy with a hint of floral and its beautiful perfume. I love this perfume. Something about it, it has a syrupy dark sweetness to it, a syrupy dark black currant essence. It is beautiful, it is womanly, intoxicating, it is a little bit playful. It's a fun fragrance, it's not a boring scent by any means. It's something about this perfume that smells you know chick yet mature and very very elegant in my opinion this is a beautiful perfume that can be worn all year round but the intensity of it is not like a super intense fragrance but the presence of this fragrance is beautiful to be worn especially during the winter nights you guys and this perfume projects beautifully on the skin with very very decent longevity i would say i get about seven eight hours i've worn this fragrance out before and come home take a shower and while i'm bathing i was literally washing the fragrance off me you know when you're bathing you can smell the scent of the perfume that you wore for the day coming off of you this is the vibe that i get from this perfume beautiful elegant and womanly scent in my opinion that definitely can be worn during the winter season you guys so this is sea intense by Giorgio armani and next up we have uh, la nuit tresor intense this fragrance is definitely one of my favorite from the la nuit tresor line now i don't hear a lot of people talking about this beautiful perfume you guys and while all of the fragrances from the la nuit tresor line are all super stars, this right here is an absolutely scrumptious smelling fragrance in my opinion this is a sour cherry sweet i want to say almost milky creamy vanilla fragrance you guys do i love this perfume i want to say this fragrance has in like a sandalwood vibe in my opinion it smells a bit cozy and warm again slightly creamy and really really pretty the sour cherry in here also is very very short lived but it's still a very intoxicating cherry scent in my opinion oh my god it's the rose the rose in the heart of this perfume it smells so sophisticated it smells rich it smells very like bold it's like a bold juicy rose and cherry combination in my opinion again the cherry kind of slips away and then you kind of get the original lenny trezor dna in this fragrance and when it dries down i want to say this fragrance dries down with a kind of like sandalwoody vibe i get something slightly creamy you guys this perfume is an absolutely beautiful smelling fragrance now it can be worn all year round but during this time of year this fragrance shines because it just has that depth to it it's a little bit dark in my opinion even though it has those fruity touches it's a bit dark with that rose in the heart it's very strong very prominent really sweet and really really pretty i want to say this fragrance i get a bit i get about eight hours wear out of this perfume the projection doesn't project like crazy after a couple hours but it definitely stays with you up to at least eight hours you guys beautiful scrumptious smelling fragrance from the lani trezor like every other lani trezor fragrance so this is the lani trezor intense next up we have mula mula by byron parfums you guys and this is a beautiful sweet fruity strawberry raspberry peach sweet vanilla fragrance with the essence of caramel there's a very prominent labdanum note in here so and a really a beautiful base backed up with oud it's an understated fruity fragrance so it comes off like a really warm sweet fruity fragrance okay you definitely get the essence of the caramel mixing with the beautiful peach and again I, the oud in here so it is quite subtle but it's there it has a base to it making this fruity fragrance not very transparent heavy in the base 
and as it, as it dries down on the skin, you get a bit more of that labdanum and those more anchoring notes in this beautiful perfume. This is an elegant womanly fragrance. It smells like a really pretty woman that's very well put together, dressed for the weather, still very, very attractive and beautiful, perhaps even, you know, extremely fashionable in her winter wear beautiful smelling fragrance in my opinion definitely a nice fruity fragrance with a very prominent caramel note that can be worn during this time of year to cut through that cold winter's night you guys i definitely love this perfume obviously i recently got this fragrance so i haven't played with it any other time of the year so during the winter time i can say to you this is a very beautiful scrumptious smelling fruity fragrance you guys so this is mula mula from the narcotic range by baron parfums next up we have barberry hob the elixir and essentially this is a a strawberry a creamy strawberry milkshake vanilla smelling perfume okay it has some strawberries and some blackberry in the opening mixing with some sweet vanilla and you definitely get that creamy sandalwood in this perfume that makes this perfume truly intoxicating it smells like a strawberry milkshake again mixing with the blackberry essence it smells almost like a cherry vanilla ice cream or cherry vanilla liqueur now i know this fragrance has some strawberries so this doesn't have like a rich strawberry essence because there's a lot of creaminess going on in here so but you get like that you know like you get like that berry essence in here so it's sweet it's a little bit milky-ish in my opinion because of that creamy heart which to me is the most favorite part of the perfume this fragrance smells delicious it smells exciting it smells exquisite it smells elegant it smells so 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 beautiful you guys this is a beautiful fragrance to be worn all year round but especially during the winter months because of that creamy warmth essence to it it is an absolute jar you guys i am in love with this fragrance i'm a little bit late to burberry so i missed the burberry intense release you guys but i will be getting my hands on the original burberry haul because i think the dna of this scent is so 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 beautiful you guys so this is a burberry haul the elixir all right, and there you have it, you guys. These are my top 10 fruity fragrances to wear during the winter season. I hope you guys enjoy these beautiful selections. Let me know in the comment section what fruity fragrances that you guys tend to pull for during this time of the year. I know, again, you guys love your spicy fragrances, your woody, amber, vanilla fragrances, but I think these beautiful fragrances backed up with those very anchoring base notes. They're beautiful combinations, very exciting and cozy all at the same time. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If in fact you did, please give me a very big thumbs up. If you guys are new here please don't leave without hitting that subscribe button make sure to hit that notification bell so that way you will be notified every single time i upload and for those of you who are my returning subscribers thank you guys for your continuous love and your support until next time see you guys in my very next video bye